Just for potential victims of the deadly campfire in Northern California. Cadaver dogs spent today looking for remains amongst the destruction in the destroyed town of Paradise. At least 81 people are dead with 870 still reported missing. This comes as Central Texas firefighters say home sweet home and just in time for Thanksgiving. Crews who spent the last week in California are now back home with their loved ones. KXAN's Eugene Show caught up with a Lake Travis firefighter who responded to the Woolsey fire in Southern California. All this hillside, so it burned up that hillside, jumped the road, and then continued up. Raging flames that didn't stop. Everything is burned. Houses, cars, everything. Just completely devastated. Until they reached what Malibu is famous for, its gorgeous beaches. A fire basically burned all the way to the Pacific Ocean. That's the only thing that stopped it. Lake Travis Fire and Rescue's Battalion Chief Eric Carlson will never be able to forget the now black hillside that once used to be luscious green. By far, it was more devastating than anything I had seen. I deployed to Hurricane Katrina and uh, saw devastation there, but to see what fire does versus water is, uh, it is, it's, it's truly remarkable. But he also saw how in some cases taking preventive steps. So essentially they were fighting the fire before the fire even started. Something as simple as keeping flammable items far away from houses could make a huge difference. Making sure that if you do have a wooden fence, treat it. You know, there's, uh, if you have wooden decks, you know, and you have a choice of materials, choose something that's non-combustible. It could take years for Californians to piece their lives back together, but Carlson saw firsthand their resilience. Really, a lot of them were thankful uh, that what they had left. Eugene Cho, KXAN News. State of California requested help from Texas through a mutual aid system that exists for disastrous situations like this one. All local departments that participated will be reimbursed by the Golden State's government. This type of firefighting support is encouraged by the federal government. States can apply actually for federal grants to help pay back other states firefighters who visit. The U.S. Fire Administration reimburses firefighters who respond to a federal property such as a national forest. Doesn't matter if it's a career or a volunteer firefighter. You can cover overtime pay for fighting the fire, food and fuel costs while out on the job, even loss or damage to equipment from working the fire.